Hey everyone, um, my name is Kylie and I'm going to be doing my first book review today. So I just finished The Poppy War, The Poppy War by R.F. Quang. Quang? I don't know. I read this book for August with a book club that I run on Facebook and I gave it three stars. The best way I can describe how I felt about this book was frustrated. <laughs> the first thing that really frustrated me in the very beginning was just how kind of off the pacing was. I found myself sometimes just really interested in it and turning the pages and then there would be another big chunk where it was just kind of boring and it was info dumpy and just I was bored. I wanted um, to see something different in it. The next thing, I and I apologize, I apologize, I'm trying to be as like spoily free as I possibly can, but the next part of this book that really frustrated me was with the main character, specifically Rin. Um, throughout the whole story, I found her um, just making some really, really dumb decisions. That's the nicest way I can put it. But she was constantly thinking in a state of, I want this, I feel this, when given the circumstances of what she deals with, particularly in the second half of the book, um, I feel like a person maybe during that time would be thinking just not quite like that. I don't know if that makes any sense or if I'm just sounding like a babbling idiot over here. I didn't really connect with any of the characters in this book. And that's not to say that there weren't some really lovable characters in the book because there definitely were, but I just didn't connect with any of them. Uh, I found them all to sometimes just kind of like mesh and sound uh, very similar. So unless, like if you had taken out the whole like this person said that, it would have I would have been pretty confused on who was saying what. I really liked that there was like no romance in this book. It was refreshing, but um, okay, let's redo this. I really appreciated that there wasn't very much romance uh, or any of those types of feelings within the book. I appreciate it. It's refreshing. I see in a lot of stories like this, there's always some sort of big grand romance and we're soulmates and whatever, but really um, there was more focus on friendship and just a general bonding. This book is not for those who don't have a strong stomach. There's a lot of very gruesome imagery. I generally have a strong stomach, but some of it was really getting to me. I'm not gonna lie there. And there's something I want to bring up because I don't see a lot of people talking about it, specifically in regards to this book, but I think it's important to bring up. There is one part in the book where one of the characters who comes off as not that likable uh, is in a particular situation and is talking about some stuff that had happened to her and that stuff involves some pretty detailed descriptions of rape and I feel like more people should be bringing that up. I haven't really looked at a lot of like Goodreads reviews, but from what I've seen around YouTube, not many people are bringing that up. So if you're gonna pick this up and you're sensitive to that kind of thing, you might wanna be warned. Um, it's about the 80% mark, uh, but it caught me off guard. And I have a pretty strong stomach when it comes to reading um, just very detailed, gruesome things. I actually had to skip the rest of that whole conversation and just kind of just set it down for a little bit until I could finish it. I found this whole thing fairly frustrating. I didn't like the pacing. I found Rin, the main character, to be just very selfish and not very thinking of others even though it might have come off that way ultimately it was because of her own kind of motivations and what she wanted i gave this i i almost dnf this the only reason that i kept reading was because of the book club um, i didn't want to let everybody who was reading along with me down um and i'm glad i did finish it and i can see why people really like it i really really do like it's there's lovable characters there's action all of that good stuff but for me I just didn't mesh with the characters, I didn't mesh with the writing style, and 
I didn't understand a lot of the main character's motivations. I just really didn't. I don't really have that much more to say about this. I am sorry if this is not the best review, but like I said, this is my first one and I hope you really like it or at least like me enough to stick around. Bye!